you want enough humidity to get the curing process, uh, you know, to have the tobacco cure, to have the flavor and aroma that, that makes our tobacco special. But if you get too high of humidity, then you have the problem with the nitrosamines being formed, which are carcinogens, and we're trying to reduce that in tobacco every way we can. I have the last pack of cigarettes that my sister smoked before she died. I've got the last cigarette pack my husband had before he died and the last pack that my son smoked before he died. At Philip Morris USA, we have a goal to be the most responsible manufacturer and marketer of consumer products. In order for us to make progress against that goal, it is very important that we align ourselves with society's expectations of a manufacturer of a product that causes serious disease. I quit uh, uh, smoking because it was, I have a, I'm a diabetic. I kept having colds and bronchitis and everything else and uh, the doctor told me, he said, as long as you're smoking, you're gonna keep having it. He said, you need to quit. I still don't think there's anything wrong with cigarette smoking. If you know that it's bothering you, then you should quit. But most anything else that's used out of moderation in life will kill you. And I just think the way that the tobacco industry has been treated and the pharma has been treated has been almost, I would say, a disgrace. Now, I know there's a lot of people died from cancer, and they say from smoking. My husband died from lung cancer, but I do not think that the cigarettes was any more cause of him dying from lung cancer than, than a lot of other reasons. I blame the tobacco industry for those deaths. Tobacco is a highly addictive substance, more addictive than heroin, 